satellites capable of piercing through storms, clouds, and even the darkest nights are now a reality, offering real-time data to monitor disasters, manage resources, and map our planet like never before. That's exactly what China has achieved with the recent launch of four cutting-edge SAR satellites, marking a bold leap in Earth observation technology. In this video, we'll uncover how this breakthrough was made, why it's reshaping the future of satellite technology, and what it means for global innovation. Stay with us as we explore the game-changing potential of these satellites and the fascinating story behind their success. At the heart of this mission is Synthetic Aperture Radar Technology, or SAR, a groundbreaking innovation that sets these satellites apart. Unlike traditional optical imaging systems, which depend on sunlight and clear skies, SAR uses radio waves to capture images. This means it can deliver high-resolution images under any weather condition, day or night. It's a revolutionary step forward in Earth observation. The four PSAT-2 satellites launched on December 16th, 2024, showcased China's mastery of this technology. Developed by Galaxy Space, a private company based in Beijing, these satellites are designed to provide unmatched imaging capabilities. But what makes SAR so special? Simply put, it's like giving satellites the ability to see through obstacles. Clouds, fog, or even complete darkness can't obscure their view, making them indispensable for applications like disaster management and geological mapping. The success of this mission is also a testament to the capabilities of the Long March 2D rocket. This launch vehicle is not only reliable but also efficient, capable of carrying multiple satellites into orbit in a single mission. With a payload capacity of up to 1.3 tons, the Long March 2D deployed the PSAT-2 satellites into a sun-synchronous orbit, ensuring global coverage and consistent imaging capabilities. What's equally impressive is how the engineers overcame extreme weather conditions to ensure the launch's success. Temperatures dropped below minus 20 degrees Celsius at the Taiyuan Satellite Launch Center, posing significant risks. Yet, with advanced thermal insulation and continuous ground heating systems, they managed to keep the rocket and its payload in optimal conditions. This isn't just an engineering feat, it's a testament to human ingenuity and determination. This mission is a stepping stone for future advancements. It demonstrates China's ability to deploy cutting-edge technology efficiently, setting the stage for more ambitious projects. With eight more SAR satellites planned for 2025, the PSAT-2 network will soon become a 20-satellite constellation capable of global, round-the-clock monitoring. The applications of these SAR satellites go far beyond just taking pictures of Earth. They have the potential to transform industries and improve our understanding of the planet. One of their primary uses is in disaster management. Imagine being able to detect flooding in real time, even during heavy storms. With SAR technology, this is now a reality. These satellites can provide crucial data to first responders, helping save lives and minimize damage. But that's just the beginning. SAR satellites are also a game-changer for land resource management. Governments and organizations can monitor deforestation, track urban development, and even assess agricultural health with unparalleled precision. This capability is invaluable in an era where resource management is critical for sustainability. Another fascinating application is geological mapping. Traditional methods of studying Earth's surface can be time-consuming and weather-dependent. SAR satellites eliminate these limitations, providing accurate data faster and more reliably. This has implications for industries ranging from mining to infrastructure development. China's broader strategic goal is clear, to build a comprehensive satellite network that serves both domestic and international needs. This isn't just about technology, it's about positioning China as a leader in the global space race. With the PSAT-2 satellites forming the backbone, the future constellation will include XSAR and CSAR satellites, enabling even more diverse applications. What's particularly interesting is the growing role of private companies like Galaxy Space in achieving these goals. By collaborating with the Chinese government, these companies are driving innovation at an unprecedented pace. This public-private partnership model could be the key to sustaining China's rapid advancements in space technology. The implications of these developments extend far beyond China. As the PSAT-2 network becomes operational, 
it will provide a wealth of data that could benefit researchers, industries, and governments worldwide. It's a powerful reminder of how space technology can be harnessed to address real-world challenges. China's recent successes in satellite technology don't exist in a vacuum. They have far-reaching global implications. With 66 orbital launches in 2024 alone, China is on track to break its own record, solidifying its position as a major spacefaring nation. But what does this mean for the rest of the world? First, these advancements represent a shift in the balance of power in space exploration. For decades, countries like the United States and Russia dominated this domain. Now, China is proving itself as a formidable competitor. Its ability to deploy sophisticated technologies like SAR at scale is a wake-up call for other nations to invest more in their space programs. Second, the growing frequency and efficiency of China's launches highlight the role of private companies in shaping the future of space. Firms like Galaxy Space and Galactic Energy are not just supporting China's ambitions, they're driving them. This mirrors trends in other countries, where private companies like SpaceX and Blue Origin are revolutionizing space travel and satellite deployment. What makes China's approach unique is its focus on mega constellations. The PSAT-2 network is just one piece of a larger puzzle that includes projects like the Guawang and Qianfan constellations. These initiatives aim to provide global internet coverage and advanced Earth observation capabilities, competing directly with systems like Starlink. However, these developments also raise questions. For instance, how will the increasing number of satellites impact orbital congestion? With more countries and companies launching satellites, the risk of collisions and space debris grows. It's an issue that requires international cooperation and regulation. On a more positive note, China's advancements could pave the way for greater collaboration in space exploration. By sharing data and technology, nations could address global challenges more effectively. Whether it's monitoring climate change, managing natural resources, or responding to disasters, the potential benefits are immense. Looking ahead, China's space ambitions show no signs of slowing down. With the debut of the Palace One reusable rocket plan for 2025 and the continued expansion of its satellite networks, the future is bright and competitive. The successful launch of the PSAT-2 satellites is more than just a technological achievement, it's a glimpse into the future of space exploration and its potential to transform life on Earth. From disaster management to resource sustainability, these satellites offer solutions to some of the most pressing challenges of our time. China's advancements in SAR technology and satellite deployment showcase its growing expertise in space. But this isn't just a story about one country's success. It's a story about what humanity can achieve when we push the boundaries of what's possible. As we look to the stars, it's innovations like these that bring us closer to understanding and improving our world. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more updates on space exploration and scientific discoveries. And don't forget to leave a comment below. Also, you can visit our website, spaceinews.com. Thank you for watching, and see you next time.